Uh, not really nervous. I mean, Colorado definitely looks good, so it should be a good game. Where are you watching? I'll be at the crib. I got my got my daughters this weekend, so I'll be at the house. Three zero start here with the defense. Kind of another fantastic performance. Is this about where you expected to be three games through? Um, yes, the goal get off to a good start. I think uh, in the past we haven't getting off to a good start and um, you know that was a focus and emphasis for us this off season was to start fast and uh, have a complete season. Eric, you guys have started to dabble with five man fronts on, on third and long with Javon in there. Um, how much do you like that alignment for the team and, and what do you think this can bring the defense as far as raising the season? Uh, it's been great. Um, we, uh, we've been trying to get that called for a few weeks now and uh, we guilted uh, Wilkes into it um, this week and you know, it was coming home, and you know, we kept going back to it. So, um, look forward to to you know bringing uh, another D lineman in the game. Ken Law has been playing amazing, so to get him on the field uh, with me, me and Hargrave is uh, inside is definitely going to bring uh, a lot of challenges for offenses. It's always tough to play in a short week. Is it better when you do it early in the year? Like days off between now, between now and next? Yeah, I would say definitely as the season stacks up, it's, it's tough later in the year. These Thursday games. Um, and it really just depends, you know, how the week went before you got banged up or what you're kind of dealing with. So, you know, um, it's always good to get a win on Thursday and have three days off to uh, regroup and refresh so, um, and, and watch other people play. Yeah, like this, exciting, huh? you this must combination be to that. is starting to gel a little bit. You got Javon fitting in. You got Ken Love playing more this year. Nick Stack. <clears throat> yeah, you know, um, our goal is to be the, the best defense in line in, in the league and, um, you know, we're taking it day by day, game by game, getting better. Um, but I'm excited, excited about the, the group we have and uh, love going to work with them and, and you know, playing uh, for each other out there. How did it feel to combine for that sack with Nick? Uh, I don't even get, we don't even get credited for it because it was two-point conversion. So, but, you know, it kept two points off the board. Um, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a dumb rule uh, <laughs> that the NFL has, I think, that, that they should change. Eric, for the, for the second week in a row, the opposition said, we're not going to try to run on these guys. They ran for 29 yards. What does that do defensively when they're so one-dimensional like that and you kind of know what you guys, what you know what you're facing when you're down? Yeah, the goal is to turn a team one-dimensional. Um, you know, as a defense, we want to make them one-dimensional, stop the run, obviously, and then uh, make it just a drop-back pass game and then go, go and get after them, get them in third and longs and um, bring the pressure. So that's always the goal each week. Um, and, you know, that's what we're going to look forward to continuing to do. Like my former teammate, Arden Key, said, stop the run so you can have some fun. Three straight games. When you have a oh, – go ahead. No, you go ahead. I was going to say, when you have an offense who can put up 30 points, how, as a defense, does that make things easier for you or adjust or, or whatnot? How do you guys – you know. Well, yeah, I uh, – I, um, I talked about this on my podcast. I love watching our offense play. They put so much pressure uh, on the defense, and they just wear them down, wear them down. And then, you know, um, those guys, they go on long drives. And so we didn't actually play that much in the first half. I think we only had like 22 snaps this game but because our offense was just controlling the ball and wearing on those guys. So our goal is always uh, get the ball back to them as fast as possible. You know, if we can go three and out, especially after they went on a 12-play drive, um, that defense is going to be really tired. You know, our offense is going to be tired, too, but, uh, you know, our, the defense is going to be really tired, too. So that's always our goal, to get the ball back in their hands. Y'all have been Last wrecking one. havoc up front. Um, three, two interceptions for the third straight game. Just how much fun is it seeing those guys reap the benefits of what you guys are doing up front? I mean, obviously, they're working hard, too, but. No, it's great. Um, you know, however you can force turnovers is uh, key, uh, a big part of winning, you know, the turnover battle. Um, we have been doing a great job thus far this year, and I think that's been a big reason why, you know, we're 3-0 and is we're winning the turnover battle. Um, we're stopping the run. And, you know, those two components to the game as a defense is, uh, is a key. And um, we've been doing a great job of that and got to keep it going.